in that time, I would just encourage every man, like, Mm. be ready for that. Understand, like, there is a season where it is even more dying to self to surround your family with a with a unit that needs your help. It yeah. needs your leadership. Your wife needs your guidance and needs your help around the home because it's just an exhausting, exhausting time. And I don't think like anyone realizes that when you talk about, you know, we talk about how marriage is sacrificial, right? And how the the best marriages are those that like compete to outserve the other, right? And die to self and sacrifice and all of that. And we We keep encouraging that. But then when you take children and add them into the picture, it's like another layer of just sacrifice. And whereas I think a lot of times, especially when we're sitting in front of couples that are dealing with that tension of adding children into the mix and handling the juggling of the day to day of the late nights and the no sleep and all of those things that can be so stressful For the guy, especially if he's out providing or the woman, if she's doing both and because there's a lot of couples that don't have that privilege. And I I say that was a privilege for me Mm -hmm. to be able to stay home. I do not take that lightly. Um, But if you are doing both and either or there's a sacrifice on both sides like and so not viewing what your spouse is doing in that season, whether or not it's sacrificing to provide or sacrificing with the late nights or doing it hopefully together sacrificing, it is sacrifice upon sacrifice upon sacrifice. And I don't think anyone goes into parenting thinking, I can't wait to sacrifice. 